Hello, my name is Dr. Diane Dyke, and this is my faithful service talk, Gracie. I have cryoglobulinemia vasculitis. It's a rare and curable blood disease that has threatened to take my life daily. I was diagnosed with cryoglobulinemia 23 years ago. It was depressing, shocking, sad, confusing, lonely. I was scared. I suffered for three years with a mystery disease and didn't know how to deal with it. It seemed that I was allergic to everything. Shopping, working, swimming, anything that I didn't realize at the time had to do with temperature changes and stress on my body. One of the biggest obstacles to living life with cryoglobulinemia is staying warm and helping others understand and dealing with the lack of knowledge about it. Help train Gracie to be my service dog so that I can more safely participate in life. I may have cryoglobulinemia, but it does not have me. I can still live a life of impact, purpose, and victory if I think of others and how I can help them instead of thinking of myself. Cryoglobulinemia means my blood turns to a thick jelly or jello-like consistency upon getting cold or stressed. Staying warm and stress-free is so important. My legs and feet turn black. The blood vessels are damaged. I can't stand, get stressed, or cold without the possibility of a flare-up, amputation, or even death. When I was finally diagnosed after suffering for three years and almost losing my legs when they turned black, there was not much information or help. We are changing that by connecting, raising awareness, and educating everywhere we can about this sometimes hidden, disabling condition. We've partnered with the Vasculitis Foundation to continue research and efforts to find a cure. I remember when I called them to let them know they had missed listing cryoglobulinemia on their website. Like most, they had never heard of it. After I sent them research and information, they quickly added us to their website brainstorm ways to increase awareness. And one of the members recommended us to the Discovery Health Mystery Diagnosis TV show which now continues to air our story around the world on Oprah's own, other networks, and YouTube, and it's called The Woman Whose Legs Turn Black. Our program has helped many to ask their doctor for the special blood test to find out if they have cryoglobulinemia. Never give up, to stay strong and courageous, and to face each day's challenges the best that I can to reduce any opportunity for having a flare-up which is pretty hard because you have to utilize full ski gear, sleeping bags, a warm therapy tub, the wheelchair. So thankful for my husband and my friends who helped me get through this. And especially Gracie. She alerts, retrieves, and enhances my blood circulation so I can more safely participate in life. Thank you for helping to bring awareness to cryoglobulinemia, this painful and dangerous disease. All of us who endure and overcome it, as well as those who love and care for us. Stay strong and courageous, and thank you so much. Yes, I have traveled. I walked the longest road. Not on my own No, never alone Yes, I have found peace Far beyond suffering Through my tears I can see you there So clear You said, child Songs 
Cheers. 